Right, recently we partnered with Torpedo 7 to bring you some epic stories from all over the corners of Aotearoa. But Auckland's lockdown sucks. I mean, has really um, locked that idea down. So, <laughs> oh, today, <laughs> we bring you skier Finn Billis from one loving, loving room. A loving living room. We're in a another. loving room. We are, as he prepares himself for the upcoming Winter Olympics. Let me out. It's been head down and on the tools for Olympic skier Finn Billis this winter, with the Beijing Winter Olympics closing in faster than my Uber Eats order of chow mein. I don't think anyone down here is ready for the season to finish, especially considering how much snow we still have. And with those two weeks that we missed, everyone's just like playing catch up with trying to get the tricks done and ready. It's crazy to think it's been four years since the last Winter Olympics. A whole pandemic and a full moustache ago for Finn, who literally was just out of high school when he competed at Pyeongchang. I had a pretty frustrating result at the last Olympics. I was, I think, 0.6 of a point off getting into the finals. So this time round, really want to um, do well in the qualifications, get through to the finals and then be able to put on the best show um, in the finals of slope style. That's kind of my main goal. And, uh, definitely working on some new tricks that I think should get me there. Ski Big Air will finally take its debut bow at the Beijing Olympics with this $32 million purpose-built jump. Finn's already dropped in on this monster at the test event and is pumped to do it again. First time dropping in was going into this like 9,400 foot um, Big Air jump and you're trying to do like the gnarliest tricks of your life. I think it's going to be pretty wild even just for spectating on the television, let alone skiing in the event. But um, yeah, I'm sure it won't hinder what is actually thrown on the jump and what tricks people are doing. And as for after the games, Finn will be switching up the park skis for the power skis. I'm looking forward to having a bit more free time to kind of uh, go do some filming and I'm looking at doing some free ride events as well. So. Uh, things I haven't quite had the time for in the last couple of years and yeah, looking forward to just, I guess, trying some new things out and exploring some new places. Anna Wilcox, crowd goes wild. Man, I can't wait to watch Beijing. Beijing is crazy how they've done it.